And with me, the best grandfather in the world, it's a family photo. Um, all right, please give it up for Alexander Calvert and Mark Pellegrino! Be your father figure, put your tiny head in mine. I will be your preacher, teacher, put it in your head in mine. I will be your father figure, I have had enough of God. I will be the one who loves you till the end of time. Generations right here, baby. Look what we made. Look what we made. Right? Come on, hey. Oh, uh, where you going, uh, Jack? Wow. Uh, you did this to me. You went with the Winchesters before. Uh, see, see. How do you feel about the Winchesters? Oh, they're fun. They're my favorites. What? You know, I love them. Uh, but, uh, right. Well, you guys had this. You know, well, because of you. Right. I know. But like that's. I mean. They're just like my there he is. Oh, I'm Jack, back. you're back. Jack's back. Look what we made. Look uh, what you guys made. It's kind of uh, real. How proud are you to have us? Thank you. Here. Thank you, Dad. <laughs> Dad, Dad's. granddad, best granddad ever. <laughs> That's questionable, but yeah, sure. <laughs> we used to talk about that when, when right before you zapped me, we were laughing at like. So we're the, calling it a zap. Yeah, it's a zap. <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. Took my god away. But um, we used to laugh at there was never a moment between you where I was like, ah, oh, my grandson. There was never Yeah, no, the writers uh, were like, we're like, ah, we're not worried about Rob. You know? Yeah. Uh, they're like, should we give him a really cute moment, you know? No. Not no. even like an appeal nothing. before he's after you, like nothing. come on man, I'm your granddad. No. There wasn't even a conversation. No. 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 It's awful. We're it's a terrible just... family. We're a toxic family. Toxic. toxic. We need therapy. <laughs> You don't need therapy. You turned out all right for some reason. Yeah. But we, Not us. We, we got issues. For yeah. someone with uh, three uncles, three fathers, you know, it's it turned out okay. Yeah, yeah you did. Well, you, had, so. you had a lot of examples in contrast, right? Yes. You had, you had the contrast of greatness with the Winchester. <laughs> yeah. So. And I had Chuck, you know. Uh, Hey, uh, <laughs> he was like, oh, there's my uh, grandfather getting the shit beat out of him by my uncles. That's cool. What? <laughs> I mean, I kicked the shit out of him, but yeah. It's, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're doing pretty good. Yeah. I was doing good until you came along. Hey, but God 2.0, you're doing great. Thank you. All right, I must go away to Thank somewhere. You. Thank you. <laughs> okay. <laughs> What's up, guys? <laughs> it's the last day of the con. Oh, it's so sad. How do you feel about the last day of the con? Well, it's the last day and the first day for me. So, uh, you know, you just put them together. So it's a, a mixed blessing is what you're saying. It's, it's Listen, a, life is a mixed blessing, truly. Oh, listen to all this philosophy coming out of you. Oh boy, I'm This is nope. deep. Nope. You're, this is a Q&A right now. You, you don't want to turn this into... This, you're right. You don't want to hear about my philosophical leanings. It's true. How you doing, Jersey? Jersey! Who would like to make some stereotypical jokes? Give it up for tracksuits! And crime! Only in like the Sopranos way. Um, what else? What else do you know about Jersey? It's, I don't know, it's the Garden State? Is it the Garden State? A lot of gardens. So does that mean there's a lot of gardens here? The Garden State is actually a trick to get you into the state. Oh, they're like, oh, you go, fun. it's full of gardens. It's great, it's going to be beautiful. Wait, you get here and... It sucks. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 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 That's whoa. intense language. Whoa. Does Jer how many people think New Jersey sucks? <laughs> Clear minority. How many think New Jersey rocks? <laughs> yeah, okay, so... <laughs> I believe the majority. Oh, girl. Philly! <laughs> Some yeah. real Philly love here, Jesus. Really? You thought that was... I thought that was a little tepid. I don't know. What's better, Philly? Or Newark? Philly now! <laughs> 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 huh? Trenton or New York City? Okay. I don't Trenton. Know. I don't know that this is leading in our productive. I'm learning a lot. Um, well, if you guys have any fun facts, please, please don't hesitate to let me know. When I first 
when I first visited New York, mm -hmm. I, I went uh, from the Trenton Station to uh, Trade Center, and um, they said that you couldn't go into the bathrooms alone in the Trenton Station. This was in the Too 90s. many sexy men? Or what? Not, not sexy men, but men who wanted to hurt you. Oh. Take your stuff. Oh, okay. Is this true to this day? <laughs> Trenton. God damn. Okay. I was, I was going for like the gay hookup zone, but like. <laughs> Instead of, I will walk in just being like, so what's up, and I'm just getting beat up. Uh, that's cool. <laughs> cool. Great. <laughs> this isn't the cruising America I dreamt of. <laughs> Only a couple people know what that is. The cruising America? Yeah. Go yeah. tell. Do tell. It's I mean, where you get an RV and you drive across the country. Yeah. And? Yeah. You meet some adorable people along the way. Hello! <laughs> My question is for Alex. If you could pick someone else to be your father, who would it be your mother? But why would I do that when I have so many great fathers here with me already? That includes that includes. No, no, that, yeah, that's including you, of course. Right, right. Um, but that being said, Nicholas Cage. <laughs> Then, and you guys are cool, but in, are you Nick Cage? That's true, we're not. But Nicolas Cage, say, in what film? <sighs> <laughs> Leaving Las Vegas. <laughs> You're dark. <laughs> you are dark. Okay, gone in 60 seconds. Gone. Gone 60 seconds. He's got cool leather jackets, he's got fast cars, he's very Winchester-y there. What about, what about National Treasure? He's got the sort of Indiana Jones thing going, right? He's an intellectual Con Air. Con Air? Oh, love Con Air. What about Pig? What about what? Pig. Pig? Haven't seen Pig. You haven't seen Pig? I haven't seen Pig. Have you guys seen Pig? Yeah! It's pretty good, right? Yeah. Yeah, you guys So Nick Cage, Pig. yeah. All right, Nick Cage. Whatever. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Hey. Oh, no! What's your sign say? Well, first of all, I show you the sign. You scared me in Vegas. You scared me in Indy. What, what would you what? do for a Klondike bar? <laughs> this is really starting to haunt me. Um, this, is, this is the convention number three, where we have been in a battle of what would you do for a Klondike bar? You and, um, you and who? Just you and her. Amanda. Amanda? Me and Amanda have been locked. You Amanda. guys are probably wondering, why? What would you do for a Klondike bar? Um, this has been a, a battle for us, and uh, I still don't have the answer, so I'd like to turn it over to Mark Pellegrino. Wait, wait, what, Amanda, what would you do for a Klondike bar? She won't do anything, is the answer. What? You'd do nothing for a Klondike bar? I don't really like them. Then why even ask the question? I thought we started it. You started it's this? It's my fault. And you don't even have an answer either? Well, my answer is also nothing. I paid this three dollars or whatever. <laughs> no. Well, that's what you, would do. you guys are so boring. <laughs> that's what people usually say at my panels. They go, "Hey, Alex, you seem like a boring guy." You know? They do not. Well, that is true. I have. It's true. But I, I wasn't going to say it out loud. No, it's kind of you. Um, so we could end with you. Do you have a Do you have an actual question? Uh, yeah, I actually did. So, am I gonna get an answer, or am I gonna get a Klondike bar answer? We'll see. Oh, okay. okay, all right. My actual question is, if you could be involved with any of the following shows, uh, 911, Walking Dead, or This Is Us, which would it be and why? Is this for both of us? You answered yesterday. Uh, what? No, 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 You see, this is why we get in fights. You hear those sassy, sassy answers. Uh, Mark, do you want to go first? I would say This Is Us. I'm a huge fan of This Is Us. I, think I have not seen an episode yet where I didn't laugh and cry, and then laugh and cry simultaneously, like hysterically. I mean, it's just such a... It's such a great show. It's such a great it show. It seems very intense, emotionally. It is. Yeah. It is. But very real, very, I, I think, relatable. There's, everybody can relate to the, the problems that they all have and the issues that they're all going through. It's great. Mm. Then there's a part of me that I wouldn't like. I, I, the Walking Dead sort of bores me. What? You guys like The Walking Dead? 
Boys Man. You know, it's like when the characters sit down and start having these long monologues about what they're doing and what's... I just check the fuck out. I'm like, I don't give a fuck. Kill zombies, for fuck's sake. What are you doing talking about your life? Who cares? Kill something. Is that how they do it on This Is Us? No, I mean, I don't expect that. Oh, when okay. I'm watching a zombie show, I want to see people getting from point A to point Z and having issues. Point C? That's good. Point A to point Z. No, that's good. Oh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, very good. So, um, but I want to see that. I don't want to see, you know... You, you want to see the carnage. I want to see the carnage, and, 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 I, and I don't want people talking about themselves. Yeah. Just stabbing. <laughs> No, but I, I want to see it. I want to see. I want to see. I want to see. Act, I want to see it in action, right? If I want to, see, if I want to watch people talking about themselves, I'll go see a play. But you're right. I'm, I'm watching a cinematic medium. I want to see the action. I don't want to hear people talking. I would probably like to be on Walking Dead, just for the murder. No, no, and not no, for the talking. Because it's the biggest show on television. It's even bigger than This Is Us, right? Uh, it depends on who you ask. No, I mean, but there are, there've got to be hard numbers that show us one way or the other. Statistically, yes, The Walking Dead has pulled in more money because it has several spin-offs, it has the yeah. comics, so it has been bigger. I like the comics. Do you work here? Do you work for The Walking Dead? What's going on? I mean, I'd love to work You're for Actually, our uh, numbers are very strong right now. Uh, <laughs> uh, wait, isn't it over? Isn't The Walking Dead over? No, it ends this year. Ten, is that ten seasons? I'm not gonna lie, I think I tuned out after after they killed Carl. Because I really just love tuning in just to see the Carl. That was the best part for me. Spoiler alert! Woo! Spoiler alert! Yeah. Wait, did you read the comics? Grow up. We have the internet. <laughs> if something's been on for ten years, it's not a spoiler. That'd be like spoiling the end of Seinfeld. I'd be like, the shit's I, over. I tuned out after Rick Grimes died. After the governor died. And then Daryl died. And then when Daryl croaked, that was the big one. I was really, he was so sexy, I didn't want him to die. With his, Can't that, let me, let me ask die. let me ask a serious question. This, uh -oh. is, this is a survival question. Uh -oh. How does Daryl kill so many zombies with all that hair in his face <laughs> and with only one part of an eye showing? He's, that's his good eye. That's, that's his good eye. Yeah, he like peers out of that one. Thank you. Oh my! Wow. Good service for the smile. Thank you. When did life get so good? What's your drink? Go ahead, tell me. Do I have to? Yeah. <laughs> it's a vanilla latte. <laughs> How many people think my drink is worse? What is it? I have a decaffeinated soy mocha with whip. <laughs> Listen, I, I didn't come here to fight, you know? Uh, hello? Hi. Um, I have... This is a question that I'm asking everybody. What video on YouTube gives you the most happiness? And have you ever been kicked out of a game for being too good? Like, like Monopoly or like a video game or what? Um, any game. Maybe just like board games. Okay. I don't know, like Trivial Pursuit or something. Do you, do you have a YouTube video that you love? <laughs> I mean, um... <laughs> yeah, I'm concerned. No, I'm afraid to say <laughs> what I look at at YouTube. Yeah, I'm, I'm concerned about your search history. <laughs> so well, when you go into private mode, what do you... <laughs> <laughs> Tell the world what you, what you, what you yeah. watch on private mode. Okay, no, I, it's not drink. that. I mean, you, <laughs> did you try to take a drink from your microphone? I was like, ah. Oh. <laughs> Chip off the old block. Yeah. When you think actors are smart, you're wrong. So, I mean... <laughs> let me ask the second... Let me answer the second one first. Okay, okay. I'm making a big deal out of this thing. You're going to be totally disappointed about my YouTube things. But, but um, board games... I, I unfortunately mostly play with my wife. Who's like Mensa and solves puzzles? Like she, she can, she can go on say words with friends on a language she doesn't speak and beat native speakers in the language because she just knows how to combine letters. And if she knows how the letters start and end in that language, she could pretty much beat everybody. And by the way, she plays Serge on words with friends in French. Oh, in Serge, French. Serge was the DP uh, of Supernatural, and she plays him every day. 
and he's won maybe twice in the last five years. I think, I think you might have to call that like words with enemies at that point. Well, and she doesn't just beat people, she beats them by hundreds of points. It's humiliating. So that I've, never, humiliating. I've never won a board game with her either. I'm like, you just have good game. You have some kind of luck that's, it's, it's freakish. I've never won a game, so I can't say. <laughs> Damn. Uh, I don't know, I feel like I always lose Monopoly, or at least I, I lose morally, you know? Eventually I just get so frustrated where I'm like, I gotta like mortgage the house. You know, it's a little too like real life for me. Uh, so I don't, I really hate that game. Monopoly never ends well. No. We played that in the 70s and it, I mean, we were already a toxic family where I came from. And just putting That's that game <laughs> just made it worse. Yeah. Uh, random YouTube video. You know, I, I used to be very simple, and uh, you know, I just love seeing people get hit in the balls. You know, <laughs> but but That's now where it was going but right. now that I've grown older, I've realized that you know, you, you get a little older, you get a little more mature, and um, the thing you love more than that at this point is still people getting hit in the balls. In the end, in the end, it's all but, about. But I also I also like watching street fights. <laughs> so. Yo, yeah, what? Street fights. <laughs> <laughs> and bar brawls and stuff like that. They're just random. Because I like to see how people fight in real life, because it's never good. Um, or sometimes you see the guy that's, you know, thinks he's a street fighter go up against somebody who knows his shit, and that's uh, interesting as well. So I watch that. I watch bare knuckle like, fights. Um, wow. UFC, I, I, I watch, you know, jiu-jitsu YouTube stuff, um, you know, stuff like that. Oh, totally vile. Street Fights with Mark. <laughs> My god. I could host, I could host a show, Street Fights with Mark. No, I'm actually more likely, like, I'm gonna, like, find a video of you, like, fighting a guy in the street. There might be one. There actually might be. Well, I think, I think the last, footage. no, the last Street Fight I got into, I don't know if they had, did they have cell phones in, what was it, 90? Nope. For, uh, well, they, they, didn't. they didn't have video, that's they didn't for sure. Have video, right. no. There were a lot of witnesses to it, but they're... they're... I, I was about to go into kindergarten then, so that's, ex that's exciting. Yeah. I was just like, oh, I gotta learn my ABCs, and Mark is like, I'm gonna teach this guy the ABCs. <laughs> of violence, yeah. Wow, that was... okay. So that's where I go to. Oh, cats are great, though. I love cat videos. They're I hysterical. like street fight oh, videos oh, of cats. <laughs> you can't combine that. You know, you get the crazy cat that like grabs the guy by the nuts and just. I want the Mark Pellegrino presents cat fights. <laughs> Hello.